If I had a change in my cholesterol levels, would it really help me? It's an excellent question. How do you get your cholesterol measured? Well, it's a simple blood test. So when you get a blood test, it'll measure your total cholesterol. That should be down below 200, hopefully below 170. And then we take that total cholesterol and we measure HDL, that's the good cholesterol, and LDL, that's the bad cholesterol. Now let's talk about both. The bad cholesterol is the part that deposits into the blood vessels. That's the LDL, that's the lousy cholesterol. And almost all of the statin drugs and eating properly will help you decrease the LDL. But we actually wanna elevate the HDL, the happy cholesterol, the good, why is that? Because the HDL will go around in the bloodstream and grab the cholesterol out of the blood vessels. So what can we do to raise the HDL? Recent uh, article uh, in um, August of 2009, Archives of Internal Medicine, talks about for every 1% that you raise that good cholesterol, there's a 2% decline in heart events, heart attacks, and vascular hardening of the artery events. So that's great improvement if you can elevate it. What can you do? Exercise will elevate it. Uh, certain of the cholesterol-lowering medicines are associated with elevating the HDL. Nicotinic acid can do that. And some studies show that taking a glass of wine a day will help elevate the HDL. I never recommend that because you never know who's going to become addicted to alcohol. But know that you need to have your cholesterol drawn, know what it is, get to work on it. 85% of cardiologists are on the statin drugs even if their cholesterol is normal. What does that tell you?